Hi everyone. Hello. Today we're going to start talking about string puppets. Yes, we are. We're going to talk about string puppets. And what you see in my hand is a traditional Rajasthani Katputli. So if you remember the first video, I had shared um, some videos of Rajasthani Katputlis, especially the work of Puran Bhatt, who is a master puppeteer. The really interesting thing about Rajasthani Katputlis are that they're often like this. It's a single, double or a four string puppet. And the puppet is manipulated with the fingers of the puppeteers. Except almost all other string puppets have crosses. So these are little wooden frames or wooden crosses on which the various strings are suspended. What the cross helps the puppeteer to do is to have multiple movements in the bodies. So the hands of the puppet, the shoulders of the puppet, the heads of the puppet uh, can all be moved. Uh, by a single flick of the puppeteer's hand, uh, the movement of the cross, it's extremely precise and mathematical, the, the making of this puppet. Because during the making of the puppet, the puppeteer determines what is going to be the movement in the body of the puppet. Uh, in string puppets in India, for example, and today we will talk about all the traditional string puppet forms in India. There are so many forms in India alone. So, Katputlis are from Rajasthan and as you would have seen in the documentary that I have shared, they were puppeteers who mostly travelled with their shows. They didn't stay in one place. They travelled the length and the breadth of the country and they made Katputlis so popular that the Hindi word for puppets is Katputli. It's synonymous with the Rajasthani traditional form. But... There are traditional puppet forms, string puppet forms across India. If you go to the east of India, Assam, Bengal have Tarit Putul and Putul Naj. There is a similar form in Tripura as well. Uh, in Orissa, there is a string puppet form called Gopalila. This string puppet form mostly has the theme of the Krishna stories. And they are very small puppets, the tiny puppets. And they are uh, suspended with strings. Sometimes there are six or seven puppets attached to uh, uh, one puppeteer's hand to one cross. Sometimes you have individual characters, the important characters. Uh, like Vasudev carrying Krishna, uh, the baby Krishna on his head and the snake on top. will have multiple strings. In Putul Naj uh, or Tarir Putul, Bengal and Assam, um, there is now a beautiful research that Sudeep Gupta from Kolkata is doing. He followed a puppet theatre company and they work exactly like the circus does. So they have tents. The tents are pitched in a village. And the company, which has not just puppeteers, but it has uh, the orators, it has uh, the carpenters, it has the people who popularize the show. So they go around um, announcing the show. They have cooks who cook for the entire team. Uh, they have managers, they have planners. So this big group travels for six months and they have two sets of everything. So while one place is watching performances and all the puppeteers are busy, the carpenters, the people who set up the shows will take the second set of tents, go to the other place where the show is going to move to next and start setting up these beautiful circus tents already. I've heard this is a dwindling form, but it is such a beautiful form and unfortunately I've only seen pictures of uh, and videos of the form. Uh, it works really like a circus so you have the little ticket booths where everyone pays their money, people walk in and each day they play three shows of the same performance and performances are not repeated so if they're in a village for 30 days they will play 30 different shows. Uh, in Bingo, uh, in Assam, uh, the string puppet form is also very much like the local theatre form, form like Jatra, a uh, little bit like Dange Putul. They perform what is locally, the stories that are locally performed in Jatra. The puppets have a very particular face structure and look. I'll share some videos. Uh, coming uh, more south, um, Andhra. Andhra Pradesh has a very interesting string puppet form. The string puppets are four to five feet tall and really heavy. They are called uh, Chika Bombalata uh, or Koya Bombalata. 
because there are two types of puppets on the show the large ones and they do the lover kush story from the ramayana and then you have small the chikas little 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 puppets uh, which are tied to one set of strings and all these puppets dance together they dance uh, when the puppeteer moves them with his finger and very often they're used for exorcisms to remove the evil eye i've tried to share a video of this as well then coming to karnataka and karnataka is interesting because the form uh is uh, yakshagana gumbayata yakshagana is also the traditional theater dance form of uh, karnataka the puppet mimics the form and the puppeteer behind the stage uh is a trained yakshagana dancer so the pu puppeteer would do the exact footwork that the puppet uh, would be doing on stage but the puppeteer would be hidden <laughs> interestingly in north kerala in kasargod you see another slightly different version of this very form except it's now called kerala string puppets the political states uh, in india came much after the traditional forms became prevalent popular and traveled um theater forms folk forms are not restricted by political boundary sometimes are not even restricted by linguistic boundary uh they literally transcend these boundaries so today the forms we describe state wise is a little bit artificial it's uh, it's now because of convenience but this is a very nuanced um um uh, classification it can't be so simple and black and white um the other string form which is from tamil nadu um, often called sutrada gumbayata are these uh, slightly smaller puppets they look a little bit like the yakshagana gumbayata but are uh, smaller and are again a very different kind of performance um i have never been uh, privileged enough to see one of these live uh this is probably the only form i really one of the two forms i have never seen live like this um so i have tried to share a video of the string puppets of tamil nadu as well uh so that's quite a few string puppets and salaki gumbayata which i had shared in the rod puppet category is also a string puppet so enjoy <laughs>